hello everyone and welcome to my channel options trader today so today in this video i will tell you how the gold price has moved uh, yesterday as well as how the gold price can move in the next two days if you look at this chart what we can see here is that after a continuous uptrend if you look at this chart what we can see here is that and a continuous uptrend and from there we have seen a continuous downtrend okay and this downtrend ha have started after the us news has come regarding the metals okay so what we have seen here there is a sharp fall okay when it was trading at a high level of 1916 has made a high of around 1916 from there it has come down to 1780 which is a very big fall okay so if you have any doubt regarding your gold position you can mail me at stock market trading live at gmail dot com or a mail id i have given in the description and please watch the full video then you will understand how this is working okay and if you wish to join my telegram channel link i have given in the description see look at this chart this is continuously an uptrend till here okay and this is the range okay so this is a very important thing what you have to understand here okay and what we can see here now that after making this uh see look at this point this is a high it has made and after touching that high it has continuously came down and was in this particular range okay so now what it did it it made a high at this level and from there it was in this particular range so there was high chances that if that thing uh, if this has broke upside we could have seen a, a new high okay and can it could have touch a level of 1958 also if it crossed upside okay now what we have seen here that after breaking this particular range and i have already told you that there is high chances that if it breaks downside because a narrow pattern was forming at this level okay so there was high chances that if you uh, would have uh, moved out at this level or created a sell position at this level we uh, could have been in a profit okay those who are my premium members i have uh, given at the these thing uh, signals to them and they may really made a good profit at this time so now what uh, you can see here okay the trend is downside we can see but the thing is that if you look at this pattern we can see that the the market was in a range bound okay so now look at this pattern what we can see here this is in a trend okay this is in a range the market is in a range so it is trying to move up or it is trying to move down but there is no direction is formed so what we can expect here the range also i can tell you the range is it made a high of 1797 okay on the day of 18th okay around mm, i'll tell you 18th of june or it made a low of around 1759 okay okay they is around 18th itself so this is the range which you have to understand carefully okay suppose if the range this is the high it has made in this particular range but after that also it was moving in this particular range as of so we a new range is created in this range okay so suppose if the price of gold moves above 1791 then there is high chances that it can touch a level of 1796 or if it goes above 1796 then there is chances that it can touch a level of 1802 and once 1802 is touched then there is chances that it can touch a level of 1816 and from there it can touch a level of 1821 and once 1821 is touched then it can there is chances that it can touch a level of 1825 once 1825 is touched then there is chances it can touch a level of 1844 and from there it can touch a level of 1863 also okay once 1863 is touched then we can expect a level of 1817 also 1870 also and from there we can expect a level of 1875 also okay or suppose if 1875 is touched then we can expect a level of 1883 so we can see there can be a change in the trend but suppose if this range breaks downside suppose if it goes below a level of 1772 then we can expect a target of 1766 okay suppose it breaks the range of 17 
seventeen seventy two then we can expect that it can touch a level of seventeen sixty five and from there it can touch a level of seventeen fifty nine so once seventeen fifty nine is touched then what we can expect that this range is break chances that but this level is already tested here once and tested here once and has tested here twice so there is high chances that suppose if it comes to close to 1759 or 60 then there is chances that it can break this level and can come to a level of 1755 and can touch a level of 1750 okay once 1750 is touched then there is chances that it can touch a level of 1733 also and if it goes below that level then it can touch a level of 1723 okay suppose if goes below 1723 then there is chances that it can touch a level of 1730 also 13 okay once 1713 is touch then what we can expect here that it can go and touch a level of 1699 but what i'm expecting is that once this range is break we can see an upside or downside movement okay so once uh, if it goes below 1700 then i'm on the full bearish side that there is chances that it can touch a level of 1676 also because this level is already here tested twice so there is chance if it comes goes below a level of 1700 then there is chances that it can touch a level of 1690 and once 1690 is touched then there is chances it can touch a level of 1679 and then it can break a low also so what i would suggest that let this range is break upside or downside because we can see a pattern is forming here okay and uh, Uh, narrow pattern is forming here so chances are very high that if it can go upside or downside okay very soon so hope you like the video and if you like the video please give a thumbs up and if you are new to my channel please subscribe it thank you.